Hey, what's to YouTube fam? It's your girl TK, and I'm in my car vlogging y'all. And I decided that I wanted to get online real quick and speak to you guys about Miss Beyonce Knowles Carter and Taylor Swift. Now, I don't know if y'all been paying attention to both of these ladies, but honestly, they have been serving a lot of reality. And if you guys haven't been noting, they have been telling you guys that, that they are the best, honey. Look at Beyonce in the Renaissance World Tour. From the United States to the United Kingdom, Beyonce is saying, bow down, bitches. No sale, missus. And, and look at Taylor Swift. Well, shit. She's giving you guys a collection, a collective of all her work via the Eros World Tour. Look at them. They're doing the exact same thing on this premiere. They're even having a movie showing you guys their work of art through time. Through time of their tour. You know, it's really a thriller if you think about it. One thing I want you guys to know here is that, you know... Seeing Taylor Swift and Beyonce actually coming together and doing work together, it's really interesting. And because let's face it, when you think about women and women in the industry competing, it's usually some type of, you know, hostility there because someone wants to be the best. But for these women to come together and say, you know what, I'm going to put my pride to the side and I'm going to support you like Beyonce has done, this mega star who is supporting Taylor Swift, that is a fucking great concept. It's a great concept that we should be embracing more often. Also, guys, I don't know if y'all realize it, but when I think about Taylor Swift, I'm always thinking of Kanye West because at one time when Taylor Swift was trying to put her name out there and she was doing her thing um, and she got an award, y'all, she got an award. Kanye West wasn't having it. Kanye West said, shit, this award belongs to Beyonce Knowles Carter. So to see that Beyonce is supporting her and still supporting her to this day is really a great thing. It is definitely a beautiful, a beautiful sight to see. Now, one thing I want you guys to note here is that, you know, honestly, they should do an album together. I can see them doing an album. My question to you is, can you see them doing an album? Because let's face it. If you look at the news as of recent, like, I don't care what channel you cut on, there's something about Taylor Swift or Beyonce Knowles Carter as of recent. Shit. So why not do a, an album together? Why not show the world that you guys are both great in your own way, your own mannerisms? You guys are both great. Beyonce, reigning queen. Taylor Swift, this Eras, you know, beauty. Why not show the world that you both can do the work at the same fucking at the same damn time? <laughs> I'm gonna put out this work at the same damn time. You know, it's I think it can happen. You know, I think most people are used to Beyonce doing, I don't know, concerts with Jay-Z. But she, she hasn't. She's adding Blue Ivy Carter, which is really, you know, something special for a mother to, who is a megastar to have her daughter on tour with her. That's a special thing. Although I have issues because, you know, Beyonce is opening her legs and saying, you know, come fuck me almost. She's saying she wants to go missing. She needs a prescription. She wants to sit on strange men. She wants to be a part of this almost appearance of a human trafficking sting. But, but her and Taylor Swift, they are both saying that they are the best. That's, that's major. They're doing the exact same thing. The eras in the Renaissance tour is a duplicate of each other. Now, ain't that a thriller? <sighs> you know what, guys? I just got done doing a video on Beyonce. It's the, um, where we were talking about how, f I think it was like, 20 plus children are going missing and how Beyonce's beehive teachers are now taking their mute challenge inside the classroom when even the, uh, you know, I should say even the adults 
didn't understand the assignment at this Renaissance World Tour. And they're telling, the teachers are telling their students in the class, children, to go on mute. Hirsch. They're implementing policies and procedures and attaching Beyonce to it and telling students to shut up when it comes to child welfare. Honestly, it's a thriller. Anyhow, I'm not going to make this video very long. Y'all should check out Beyonce as well as Taylor Swift. Peace, love, and happiness. Bye.